One example uh, from two years back when we started working with an NGO based in Washington state is called the Nisqually Foundation. So they monitor the movement of salmon in the waters in the Nisqually River. So they have underwater camera traps which take short bursts of video about anywhere from 15 seconds to a minute. And these videos are reviewed by trained biologists to identify the species of salmon. Firstly, what is the, the fish which has passed through the, the, the camera trap and what species of salmon uh, it belongs to. It's a heavy manual effort because there are false triggers. At times, there's no fish in the video. At times, uh, it's just a minute long and you have a couple of seconds of sighting. It, it is not scalable. And when we tried applying AI to it, we showed 1000 videos of salmon to this AI model. And with that learning, it was able to detect and accurately identify uh, the 12 species of salmon. And uh, it drastically cut down the effort in what about 80% of savings in effort. And it was a scalable model which could be readily replicated around. This is one example of how uh, using computer vision and uh, application of AI in that area, we can detect species and uh, be able to automatically identify not just the, the, the species, but also there are other examples we can identify the individual animal aspect.